KS Heating and Air, the team ensuring your comfort. It's the Weather Extreme video, the morning edition. This is for Monday, the 20th of April. I'm James Spann. Alabama's weather improving today with a clearing sky. Next chance of storms will come Wednesday night and Thursday morning. We'll take a look at that as we go. And first off, the progression of the storms across the state over the past 24 hours. Started off yesterday morning early with one nasty bow echo coming through Chilton, Coosa, Tallapoosa counties, widespread wind damage with that. And then we had more storms late yesterday and last night, mainly over the southern part of the state where the air was unstable. But those storms are pushing out. Dry air comes in today. We'll expect a clearing sky. That was the regional radar composite at 456. Thunderstorms coming through extreme south Georgia and northern Florida. Temperatures mostly upper 50s, low 60s to start the day. Birmingham at 60. We'll expect a high in the low 70s today. Got tornado watches for parts of North Florida and southeast Georgia. Coastal South Carolina with those storms. Still a flash flood watch for Georgia. That'll be expiring soon. There's the severe weather outlook today. An enhanced risk on the coast of South Carolina around Charleston. Got a marginal risk north and west of the state over Missouri and Arkansas. Tomorrow, marginal risk for the Northeast United States and a risk over parts of the Texas and Oklahoma panhandles back toward Oklahoma City. And day three, Wednesday, and keep in mind this runs through 7 a.m. Thursday, got a risk of severe storms, the standard slight risk from central Texas over into the deep south. And again, this goes through 7 a.m. Thursday in Alabama. That slight risk noses into the far western counties of the state. The marginal risk is far east as Birmingham. And we'll talk more about this setup in just a moment. Here's the rain for the next seven days, valid through Monday morning of next week. Again, the southeast pretty wet. Rain amounts here about one to two inches, maybe isolated heavier totals for the southern half of the state. So model fans, let's go. Here's the GFS. This is the OZ run, valid today at four. Troughing over the east, the storms are gone. The sky clears. Morning clouds, afternoon sun, low 70s. Tomorrow should be a dry day. Mostly sunny with a high in the mid to upper 70s. And then Wednesday, here comes our next system. Surface low is a little east of Oklahoma City. Clouds will likely increase and rain and storms will likely move in here Wednesday night. This is Wednesday night, a little after midnight. From the GFS, got a surface low that's over Arkansas. European, almost the exact same spot. And then 1 o'clock Thursday afternoon, that surface low is north of Nashville. And at that point, the deeper moisture begins to move out. So it looks like a midnight to noon thing. Uh, midnight, Wednesday night through noon on Thursday. Uh, there's some degree of instability coming off the European. Again, this is Thursday morning. This is the 12-kilometer NAM on Thursday morning. And again, until we get within 60 hours, that's when these convection-allowing models, the really high-res models, the 3-kilometer models kick in. Um, so we'll mention a chance of rain and storms Wednesday night, Thursday morning, maybe strong to severe, especially for the western and southern counties, and much more clarity on this as we get closer. So Friday, everything is out of here. We are dry during the day, but Friday night, here comes the next system, a deep surface low that's on the Ohio River, and that might bring some strong storms Friday night. And then by Saturday, that stuff is on the way out. So with that feature, it looks like Friday night, early Saturday morning followed by a clearing sky, and then Sunday looks dry, sunny with a high close to 70, and here's a week from today, Monday the 27th, troughing to the east, then again we're rain-free. Let's go out 10 days. This is Wednesday of next week, the 29th. Again, troughing over the east, looks like a front coming through maybe earlier in the day. Here's the rain for Birmingham off the European Ensemble, the mean between 3 and 4 inches for the next 15 days. Temperature is very seasonal through the end of April. Highs mostly in the 70s, lows mostly in the 50s, and 
This is the CPC outlook, April 27th through May 3rd, suggesting temperatures at or maybe just below average for our state. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this morning. We'll have notes in the blog. Next video here by 4 o'clock this afternoon. If you can't catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6, and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and God bless. Never wait for hot water again with a tankless water heater from Plumbing Experts. Tankless water heaters are easy, convenient, and now more affordable with a no interest financing for up to 18 months. Stop with the cold showers and wasted water and call Plumbing Experts today.